the Grand Canyon, one of the most majestic and awe-inspiring natural wonders of the world. But beneath its breathtaking beauty lies a dark side, filled with controversies, destruction, and the ongoing fight for control. Welcome to The Daily Hit, where we explore untold stories and unspoken truths. Today, we're diving into the environmental destruction and land disputes surrounding the Grand Canyon. Remember to hit that subscribe button and stay until the end for some truly eye-opening revelations. The Grand Canyon has been a battleground for uranium mining since the 1950s, and the devastating effects on the environment and local communities are undeniable. Companies have left a toxic legacy that still haunts the region, threatening the health of the Colorado River, wildlife, and indigenous communities. With thousands of abandoned mines dotting the landscape, radioactive contamination has seeped into groundwater and soil, resulting in alarming levels of cancer and other diseases among nearby residents. Despite the 20-year mining ban enacted in 2012, powerful lobbyists have pushed for exemptions and continue to threaten the delicate ecosystem. The Colorado River is a lifeline for millions, but its future is uncertain due to decades of overallocation and mismanagement. The fight for water rights between states, agricultural interests, and Native American tribes has intensified as climate change-induced droughts deplete the river's resources. Compounding the problem is the alarming reduction of the river's flow caused by the Glen Canyon Dam, which has been widely criticized for its ecological consequences. The dam has disrupted natural sediment flows, leading to the erosion of vital habitats and endangering numerous species. The Grand Canyon has been a sacred place for Native American tribes for centuries, but the struggle for land rights and sovereignty remains a contentious issue. The Havasupai tribe has fought for decades against mining and tourism projects that threaten their ancestral lands, but their rights continue to be undermined. Recent court decisions have highlighted the ongoing struggle between tribal rights and commercial interests, with many feeling that the government has failed to protect the cultural and environmental significance of the Grand Canyon. Tourism is a double-edged sword for the Grand Canyon. While it generates significant revenue and provides jobs, the sheer number of visitors is taking a toll on the fragile ecosystem. Erosion, pollution, and wildlife disruption are just some of the consequences of mass tourism. With more than 6 million visitors per year, the pressure on the environment and local communities is immense. The challenge lies in finding a balance between economic gains and preserving the area's unique natural and cultural heritage. The fate of the Grand Canyon has long been a political chess game, with various parties vying for control and influence. From federal and state governments to corporations and indigenous groups, the fight for control has often resulted in environmental policies taking a back seat. This power struggle has hindered the implementation of effective conservation measures, and the canyon continues to suffer the consequences. In a world where the environment is facing unprecedented challenges, the need for cooperation and decisive action is more crucial than ever. The Grand Canyon's dark side is a sobering reminder of the delicate balance between human ambition and the natural world. As we've explored today, the fight for control over this iconic landmark has given rise to controversies and environmental destruction that threaten its very existence. But there is hope. By raising awareness and working together, we can help protect this incredible wonder for future generations. So join us in our mission to uncover the hidden stories and support the fight for a better, more sustainable world. If you found this video eye-opening, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to The Daily Hit for more thought-provoking content.